Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Mike. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You know what I'm saying? Hit that post notification bell so you know, you know when your boy is dropping that new shit. As y'all can see by the title, mm, we're gonna go over a gun review for this Ruger 5.7. As y'all can see, we are cleared. It's Ruger 5.7, y'all. I like it. I like it a lot. Recently just took this particular gun to the range and I had a real good time with this gun. A um, uh, couple of things about this. Chambered in 5.7. Um, if y'all seen some of the 5.7 bullets, they look like little mini AR style bullets. Um, here is a comparison. This right here is a 5.56 round. And this right here is a 5.7 round. As you can see, they pretty much look just alike. But you're getting this out of a handgun. Like, that's crazy, right? It's super light. I like the ergonomics on this gun. Other videos I did go over this particular gun in my gun collection video but i wanted to do a standalone five seven video and kind of show y'all uh what ruger is offering man i mean like i said this is a pretty clean gun i like the ergonomics with it um for the longest time nobody i don't think was really making five seven guns other than fn the you know what i'm saying that fn five seven I'm just unfamiliar with the round, so I'm not sure in what capacity I would use a 5.7 round in. It, it, I mean, like, it's a full-size gun. I mean, it's, it's mad easy to shoot. It feels good in your hand. Let's see. We're holding 20 rounds. And anybody, anytime you can get a standard 20-round mag, that's, that's, in a handgun, that's, that's a lot. But let me know in the comments what y'all think about this Ruger 5.7. I definitely have some footage of the range uh, with this particular gun. It's a, it's a fast shooting gun too. Now, when I did talk about this particular gun in the collection video, we did go over the trigger. So, Shooting the gun and when I was doing the trigger pulls, you see how much take up it has? It didn't really feel like that when I was actually shooting the gun. Travel was a little long, but I mean, I was back on, I was shooting pretty quick with the gun, so as far as the standard trigger on here, that's not bad when you actually shoot it. The front serrations that it has on the front, definitely a good feel. Ported slide, nice look. Not sure if they make aftermarket barrels for uh, the Ruger 5.7, but that might be something that I want to look into because if I could get a ported barrel, clean that would definitely be an upgrade that i would look into putting on here a uh ported ported barrel only thing that this thing doesn't have is it's not optic ready so no optic sight but we do have a fiber optic front sight on there so that's nice I have a rail that you could put you know a nice full size light on there be something that i might put on here uh, just cause I like to dress up my guns, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it is what it is. If y'all see some of my other stuff in my collection, I like to, you know what I'm saying? Put some, some perks and attachments on them. You feel me? So yeah, man, Ruger 57, y'all. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think about this. Uh, like I said, I definitely had a good time at the range with this gun. It's a, it's a nice shooting gun, y'all. 
nice shooting gun. Hey guys, so let me know. Let me know in the comments. Ruger 5.7, Chamberlain 5.7, for the 20 rounds in the mag. And definitely fun to shoot though. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. Like I said before, if you're new, definitely hit that subscribe button. Definitely hit that post notification bell so y'all know when I'm dropping new gun content, when I'm dropping new range content, anything. Uh, definitely check the playlist. I got a ton of stuff if you're interested in. I do a lot of different stuff. I do kennel stuff, car, truck stuff. I do gun stuff. So pick your poison. I appreciate the support. And uh, until next time. I have